Look at how adorable they are together. Yes. Disgustingly so. You know, I think they found a whole new way of loving each other. If we all claim to do it as it has never been done before, I just don't know how people are gonna do it in the future. So Poppy, we figured we'd cook you one of our specials for dinner. Which is? Roast chicken. Polenta. Mushrooms. And red Italian peppers. <laughs> but first, darling, come, let's show them our new place. Yes. <laughs> so, Elaine, how did you meet Poppy? Um, well... You've been in love, of course. If you haven't, you've got it to come. Love's like the measles. Everybody has to get it once. But, you needn't be afraid of catching it a second time. In fact, the woman who has had it can go into the most dangerous places with perfect safety. She can keep her head through the whirl of a close dance, catching nothing more lasting than a cold. She can look into sunny eyes and not be dazzled. No, we never sicken with love twice. Garlic, please. Of course, my love. Pepper, please. Certainly, darling. Oh, it's like a Disney movie, only more cutesy and annoying. They make such a good team. <laughs> Seriously, I'm like waiting for the stove to start singing. I think everything will survive in there while we have a drink. <laughs> You're welcome. So, Poppy, what are your intentions with our lovely Elaine? My intentions? Mm -hmm. uh, well, I think um, lots of wild kinky sex. Uh. And then, you know, just chuck her out into the street when I get bored. <coughs> mm -hmm. Thanks. So, you're not looking for love? Mm, oh, maybe. I'm... It's all very complicated. Isn't it, you know, being in love? I know. We used to fight all the time, but it's, it's better now. Our love really sustains us now. Well, what else is there? And if you don't have someone special in your life, you might end up like Loretta, nagging everyone to death. Oh no, I doubt Loretta will catch Poppy in her web. You can bet on it. <laughs> Ooh, water's boiled. Mm. Time for stage two. Mm -hmm. They have such a great relationship. Uh, uh -huh. I can see that. I mean, it's all based on honesty, about their past, about the future that they want, about their goals, everything. So there's Elaine covered head to foot in bright green vomit. And that's when my mother shows up. <laughs> okay. I think it's that time again. I need to get up early in the morning for work. Hey, mm. Poppy, what do you do for work? Oh, um, <clears throat> I work from home. Mm. I'm still usually late. Better get going then. Especially if you have all that kinky sex to have first. <laughs> I'm just saying. Mm-hmm. <sighs> what, are you switching the juice? Should we tell them the news? Go on then. We're going to have a baby. Oh my god. <laughs> That's so wonderful. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> Thank you. 
In reality, even those who seize love's opportunity will have to deal with its waning. We take all things in a minor key as we grow older. Ambition takes a lower aim. Honor becomes more reasonable and love, love dies. A young couple cannot call to mind any middle-aged people that exhibit such frantic attachment, but that does not interfere with their belief in themselves. No. No one has ever loved as they love. And so, of course, the rest of the world can be of no guide in their case.